it's Laura and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing really well. Today I'm going to be doing a little hair dye video. So I'm going to be dyeing my hair pink using the new Shrine Drop It hair dye. This one here. So I've never actually tried anything like this before. Inside the box you get a little mixing bowl and like a little spatula thing to mix the colour with. And the colour itself comes in like a little glass bottle with a little pipette on the top. I love how it actually comes in like a little glass bottle so you actually get no plastic waste in this at all. Also what I absolutely love about this to create any kind of colour you can usually use between 6 and 30 drops. So you're going to get so much use out of one little bottle. Whereas normally if you buy yourself a hair dye bottle it takes. Usually takes about two bottles just to even cover my length hair. So I'm going to get so much use out of this. I think it's such a good idea. So how I'm going to mix this dye is it's got a little line inside of the bowl just here. I'm going to fill conditioner up to that level. And then I want quite a brightish but not too bright pink. So I think I might go for around about 12 to 20 drops in this one. So this is the conditioner in. I'm going to add the drops in now. As you can see by my hair I have got yellow at the front I've literally just dyed this so I'm gonna clip these bits out of the way and section them off just so I've got nice clean sections to do the pink with yes yeah, so if you would like to see this hair dye tutorial then just keep watching just dried it and straightened it quickly um i'm absolutely obsessed with the color like it's came out like such a nice candy floss color pink and i think the pink with the yellow just looks unreal i absolutely love it and also the thing that i love about them colors is as well like with your adding it in with conditioner while it's processing it's kind of like a conditioning treatment on your hair so when you wash your hair it feels so soft after so my hair feels like unreal I will also leave the links to the colours and everything that I've used down below just in case you want to go and check them out. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see more videos from me. Thanks for watching.